His name is Albert Hubbard. He was the man who really started the arts and craft movement here in the United States. And it all began right here in western New York at the Roy Croft campus in East Aurora. Tonight, our man Mike Randall has more on who this man was. He's probably the most famous American that nobody knows anything about. Alan Nowicki is talking about Albert Hubbard, the man who started the Roy Croft movement and so much more. I've always been fascinated by Buffalo history and I'm amazed at how much Albert Hubbard is intertwined into so many elements of Buffalo. He got hooked on Hubbard 11 years ago when he was putting together a documentary about the man for WNED TV. Alan is now the program director for the Roycroft campus. And I just fell in love with the place and I've, I've been here ever since. Regarded as a great businessman, Hubbard quit the rat race and created a place where artists and craftsmen could shine. He realized that life wasn't just about money and he left a very, very lucrative position to go off and do what he believed life was about and that was like being happy in your work. Folks visit the Roycroft campus from all over the world to learn about what Hubbard started here. But we've been slowly restoring this back to the way it would have looked back in Albert Hubbard's day. For people interested in the life and times of Albert Hubbard, Alan will be presenting a four-part virtual course. It's really a deep dive into Albert Hubbard's life. Alan says he'll also share many of Hubbard's ideas. One of his ideas eventually becomes baseball cards. One of his ideas for business turned into how Avon and Tupperware run their business. Each of the classes will be about an hour, and they are free for members, $50 for non-members. If you want to sign up for the classes, they start this Saturday. You can get more information at the website. Albert Hubbard was a great storyteller and known for his many famous one-liners like, a friend is someone who knows all about you and still loves you, and do not take life too seriously, you will never get out of it alive. And one of Alan's favorites, if you talk in your sleep, don't mention my name. <laughs> That's good advice. In East Aurora, Mike Randall, 7 Eyewitness News.